A newer trend in medical tattooing is giving people a whole new outlook on life, especially during a pandemic. Medical reporter Liz Bonus explains how. Hey everybody, hello to you. For many of us, these COVID-19 times have led to flexibility to work and home time, and that allows us sometimes to take more time to heal. For some, that means taking back a part of their lives they have struggled with for years. I just didn't like the way I looked when I got dressed, you know, I dressed up nice in these glaring bright white spots on my skin like, uh. For years, Karen Cujo told me she struggled with a common problem which causes the skin to lose its pigment called vitiligo. Close up, it looks like this. So ankle and arm, are there mm -hmm. other places you have some goals for or are those your last two or where are you in this journey? I have one on my breast. I have a tiny one here. So Cujo made the decision to think outside traditional treatments. And while she had flex time in this COVID-19 time, she decided to think ink or what's called vitiligo camouflaging. It can last anywhere between three to five years. It's it's pigment that is designed, it's different than tattoo ink. We use um, permanent makeup pigment that instead of retaining color for a long time and maybe turning color, um, because uh, typical tattoo inks can kind of change color as they, as they, you know, they're built for longevity, they're not built for color retention. Shannon Housley of the Housley Institute for Restorative Ink says this kind of ink can help color match to most of the areas of your own skin. You can do severe. It's going to take longer. It's probably going to take more sessions. Um, typically on areas like fingertips, it, it's not going to retain color as well as, you know, maybe up on your arm or on your leg. So we want to be careful when we work in those, those to have good realistic expectations of what the coverage is going to look like. In just a few sessions with Cujo, as you can see in these photos provided by the Housley Institute, the results are pretty dramatic. So much so that Karen Cujo says when it comes to her confidence, she feels... Oh, fantastic. I couldn't believe it. When she got finished, I'm like, oh, I could have kissed her. If it wasn't, if it, if it wasn't, we weren't in a pandemic, she would have got a big hug and kiss from me. But, <laughs> but um, yeah, I mean, I was singing when I left the office. I was singing. I twirled around. I was like, I feel pretty. <laughs> Now, generally, this costs about $150 per area, Shannon says, but she has done some additional training in medical tattooing and will do a consultation for free to see if you are an appropriate candidate. For more information, you can call 513-454-6911 or visit whatshappeninginhealth.com. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonus. We'll throw it back to you.